Hey gang, I'm Garrett and these are reviews from Mob.org. Let's go! There are some very strange things in the world, but there are also some very special strange things. Just imagine the refined humor of South Park united with the madness of a Japanese TV show. Did you manage to do that? To be fair, I didn't. That's why I downloaded this game. So, while we're waiting for a release of South Park The Game, Gamehouse Studios presented us with a marvelous arcade game, South Park Mega Millionaire. Don't be afraid of the word millionaire. This is not an analog of a famous quiz show with a number of questions for curious idiots. You have something better here, but all in good time. The plot of the game is based on the fact that our friends want to earn some money by participating in a TV show. What can be easier? But a whole lot of unforeseen circumstances are revealed as the game progresses. The problem is that the Japanese have a rather weird sense of humor, and the local viewers adore watching the torture of the show's participants. Screw you guys, I'm going home, Cartman wanted to say before, but changed his mind as an entire million bucks was at stake. This is how greed outweighed the good sense in that small salad dodger. But this is only the beginning of the horror. According to the rules of the game, the players have to overcome an obstacle course, as in classic arcade games, collecting money and special chips on their way. But it would be good enough for the European show. The venturesome Japanese went forward. You have to beat everything with rollerblades on. Seems to be a trifle, but it essentially changes the whole game. Very often, it is impossible to take into consideration the constant slipping and rollbacks. It adds a lot of surprises to the simplest levels. So, as you can see, you can't fall into vats of brown oil, even if it is oil. <laughs> Though, there are some pluses even in this case, as you'll get special bonuses for the stupidest of achievements. Besides the gloom, Japanese TV geniuses invented a lot of fine tests, such as carrying bonsais on your head or tea delivery to malicious pensioners. The obstacles on your way are also original. Sumo wrestlers, rabbit men, and huge fugu fish. Jokes from the TV presenter also add its portion of madness, as they are as schizoid as the show itself. Besides, the game has a really great base of sounds. In the game menu, you can listen to all the most famous quotes from the characters in the series. Taking into consideration the specificity of the Japanese show, most of them are dirty words. Let's pass on to the game's highs and lows. The gameplay itself is the main advantage of the game. As mentioned above, such a simple idea as roller skates make you look at the standard arcade game from a completely different angle. Good animated graphics is also an advantage, as it perfectly conveys the atmosphere of the hellish TV show. Poor controls is a big disadvantage. It's realized in two variations there. Tap on the screen and the accelerometer. A good control is the most important thing for any arcade game. That's why developers had to add standard virtual keys like in the majority of similar games. One more disadvantage for fans will be little relation of the game to the actual series. As a result, it's quite a qualitative project based on a well-liked serial full of fresh ideas. Due to which originality is a game, South Park Mega Millionaire will be enjoyed not only by fans of South Park itself, but also lovers of good, interesting arcade games. That's all for today. If you liked it, then download, like this, subscribe for the channel, and join the group. There are tons of interesting things there. This was Garrett and reviews from Mob.org. See you soon. Get it, man. No, he can't read.